today the promise of the lord is from book of jonah book of jonah chapter 2 verse 9 in some bibles and in my bible new community bible book of jonah chapter 2 verse 10 it is so the word of god says that is today's promise saying and giving courage to us that whatever you want today whatever you are in need and whatever for what we are praying will be fulfilled through the promise of the lord today what the lord is going to give us jonah chapter 2 was 9 in some bibles and in my bible it is jonah chapter 2 verse 10 book of jonah chapter 2 verse 10 but i with the song of praise will offer to you sacrifice jonah says lord with the song of praise i will offer to you my sacrifices what i have vowed i will fulfill and deliverance will come from you from the lord but i with songs of praises will offer to you sacrifices what i have vowed i will fulfill deliverance comes from the lord so jonah says in jonah chapter 2 verse 9 whatever offerings i have to offer you lord i will offer you through songs through praises so my dear people of god i to love to offer everything to the lord through praises and through new songs you see whenever friday comes i try to sing a new song and praise god and in that song if you see all the requirement of our people those who are coming to the prayer and of me and of our ministry will be there so i put everything into that song and i praise god and worship him and ask him lord bless your people as i am singing as i am praising and fulfill all the vows whatever you have made to them and in the same way here jonah says what i have vowed i will fulfill so when we vow something how to fulfill through praises through praises singing songs new songs and that becomes a sacrifice to the lord and the lord says i will deliver you so when you offer your sacrifice and when you fulfill all your vows the lord says i will deliver you from all the situations and circumstances so where all you need deliverance today where all you need healing today where all you need protection to your husband your wife your children and to your family to your business to your job whatever it is even if the child is in the womb or born if any problem is there if you give your sacrifice and fulfill all your vows to the lord the lord says i will deliver my people from all the illness and sickness and i will command my angels according to psalm 91 so that my angels will take charge of you that nothing can harm you so the lord is giving an assurance when you fulfill your vows and when you give praises to me and offer the sacrifices of praises i will deliver you from all kind of poverty jesus see according to the scriptures we see in philippians chapter 4 verse 19 it says i will supply everything according to i will supply everything from my kingdom according to my treasure so his treasure is so much according to his treasure means he has lot of treasure you cannot measure it so through that he said i will fulfill everything when you have more you can receive you can give more so according to his treasure means i have more i can give you more i have overflowing i can bless you overflowing exceedingly i can bless you 
more than enough i can bless you more than your imagination i can bless you says according to me and my riches i am going to bless you said amen so my dear people of god if you want to receive the blessings and if you want more than enough you have to fulfill your vows you have to fulfill all the praises what you have to offer to god sometimes we vow to god sometimes we vow to god lord i will fulfill this i will do that i will do anything whatever i can do but at the moment when the time comes we turn our faces we turn back to god last week i heard a small testimony of one of my uh, colleague so he says brother i have to give my daughter's hair because on 8 september my daughter's hair have to be removed so i cannot go to velangani because because of uh, uh, corona virus so i am not able to go so i will give my daughter's hair in kartabad in our lady of health church i said okay good i told the whole family you should give your hair not only your daughters but you also give when you take away see when you give give whole heartedly so they decided to give but later after 2 3 days he changed his mind his desire because somebody told no no you can you have to go there only and you have to give there only in velangani so see we make an vow and we don't fulfill then how you will get deliverance we cannot change our mind when somebody says something or so today one is telling you don't go one will tell you go but in all those things you cannot fulfill the desire of god what has come into your heart because yesterday i have told the desire will come to into your heart according to philippians chapter 2 verse 13 from the lord so when you get the desire when you are not able to go to velangani you can fulfill here also mother mary did never said to come there or here she is eagerly waiting that you are there in your vow you are there in the word of in what you have promised to her so that you may get deliverance so many change like that many say brother we will keep prayer tomorrow and day after tomorrow when the day comes they call in the morning and say brother something happened all of a sudden they change their mood their mind something wrong will go in their house and they want to stop that day's prayer here many things happen like that for that only here who jona says i will fulfill all my vows and i will offer my sacrifices jona was delivered when he was in the belly of fish in the belly of fish he was there for 3 days in the dark room he was not able to see anything in this world at that moment he offered everything to the lord he offered the songs he offered the sacrifice he fulfilled all his vows he said whatever i said lord i am going to do and whatever you say i am going to do in the same way if you see in psalm 51 psalm 50 verse 14 offer to him a sacrifice of thanksgiving who says king david so whenever king david wanted to offer anything he went before the lord and he offered a song of thanksgiving praise is he offered and fulfill your vows to the most high he says so whenever you go in the presence of the lord with a song of thanksgiving and in your heart if you have lord today i am going to fulfill all my vows in your presence what all i have done and continue to do that and deliverance day by day day by day will increase in your life and then he says in psalms 50 verse 15 call on me in the time of calamity i will deliver you and you will glorify me so when you offer the song of thanksgiving and give all your vows to the lord sacrifice to the lord like job 
then the lord says call me in the time of calamity wherever you are whatever situation you might be call me i will deliver you i will heal you i will bless you i will lift you above everything in this world where you will have above all in this world everything whatever you require so my dear people of god today only the lord can will can be our refuge only he can be our fortress so king david says you are my refuge you are my refuse your lord jesus for being our friend always to bless us and protect us and save us from every day man harm and every danger lord i thank you i praise you for blessing all your people i make this prayer in the mighty name of jesus christ of nazareth Amen. i believe i declare all those who have heard will receive your blessing in the mighty name of jesus christ of nazareth i pray Amen. 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 Amen.